somebody asked the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi of all the things I should fear about Allah, what would you consider top on the list? The man said, Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi said to the man, you should fear Allah's anger with you. And he asked the Prophet, and what should I do so as to avoid Allah's anger with me? We keep playing, praying Allah, إِهْدِنَا سِرَاطَ الْمُسْتَقِيمِ سِرَاطَ الَّذِينَ سِرَاطَ الَّذِينَ نَمْتَ عَلَيْهِمْ غَيْرِ الْمَقْدُوبِ عَلَيْهِمْ You know, you ask Allah for guidance, the path of those who earn your favor, not the path of those who earn your anger. The man asked the Prophet, what should I do so that Allah is not angry with me? And the Prophet Wasallam said, don't you get angry with others. A person who cares about God consciousness is one who would really do their best to restrain their anger. Will not allow their anger to get into the way of their relationship with Allah. And so the topic of God consciousness, as Sheikh Ibrahim mentioned, it's not just when you, when you hear righteousness, being a good Muslim, having taqwa, it's not about acts of worship. That's introduction to the whole subject. Taqwa is measured by the amount of rahma and compassion you have towards others. If you have no compassion to others, stop deceiving yourself into believing, I'm a good Muslim, I have taqwa. The Prophet ﷺ said, Allah is more impressed by the ignorant believer who is kind and helpful to others than the strict, regular worshipper who is miserly and has no good to offer others. When the Prophet was taught about, to, told about a lady, she was very serious. She died. And she was told about the Prophet, the Prophet ﷺ was told about her that she was very kind. People liked her. She was good to people, but she was not very serious when it came to acts of piety. She just did the bare minimum. The Prophet ﷺ said, here fill Jannah. She is in paradise. And then was told about another woman. She prayed and fasted and did all the right things to do with ibadah. But she had nothing good to say about people, and people had nothing good to say about her. And the Prophet said, here fin nar, she's in hell. Don't get deceived by just acts of worship if it doesn't change you to do good. <laughs>